Um, I would love some tips on kind of how to, I guess, manage that um, very connected empathy when when you when you are in, as you said, a helping profession, mm-hmm. and you are surrounded by, for example, kiddos that all have very traumatic pasts. They are all, you know frequently in a, in a very activated state, wondering how to kind of like step back from your own reflection of that and be able to respond appropriately as the person in a helping role rather than getting caught up in your own being able to empathize. Right. Oh, excellent question. Um, I believe first it starts with you, you know, I'll, I'll speak for, for myself, um, my own state to begin with, uh, am I rested? Um, am I in, is my physical health okay? I know that when I, when I am in a healthier place, when I'm restored myself, um, not depleted, I have more of an ability to deal with other people's emotions and not be so affected. Of course, you're not going to be in an optimal state all the time. I don't know anyone who is. Um, so, some of the other things that, that I practice are really pausing and taking a breath, being able to, to really self-reflect and be aware in a moment of, of what, what I'm feeling that's mine and recognizing that like, okay, this, this other person in front of me is reactive. They are, um, they're going through something and consciously reminding myself of what is mine and what is my role in that situation? Like if I can understand them that deeply, that gives me an ability to help them, but not if I'm being overwhelmed by their emotion. So it's a lot of a very a mindfulness, mindful awareness of what I'm experiencing. Um, and then a process of being able to release all of that energy when the interaction is done. Um, one of my friends who's a psychotherapist and has been for over 20 years um, and is highly sensitive is able to meet with, you know, eight clients a day, one after the other, after the other. And I asked him how he does it. And he has a process of, of really this, this, a few moments of self-care, this process of before he goes into a session, really clearing himself and afterwards really clearing himself. Um, it's, it's, it takes conscious effort and mindfulness and awareness to be able to not be overwhelmed. And then there's still times when it is overwhelming 